During pneumonectomy, that's to say removal of the lung, the surgeon cuts the pulmonary ligament and retracts the lung. Which of the following structures forms the pulmonary ligament? The pulmonary ligament, by definition, it is a double fold of mediastinal parietal pleura that hangs below the root of the lung. This is the root of the lung. And we can see that at the root of the lung, there is a bronchus here. By the way, this is the left lung. You can see the lingula and the oblique fissure. And here is the impression for the arch of the aorta. At the root of the lung, we can see here, this is the pulmonary artery, the artery above, then the bronchus behind it. And then the pulmonary veins, which carry the oxygenated blood. There are two pulmonary veins related close to the inferior aspect of the hilum of the lung. Now I'm going to draw a green line representing the mediastinal pleura, parietal mediastinal pleura, and at the lower part of the root of the lung, there will be a double folding here of the mediastinal pleura, which will form the pulmonary ligament. So the pulmonary ligament is related to the lower part of the root of the lung. It's like a, a cuff of a sleeve, a double fold of parietal mediastinal pleura. The function of the pulmonary ligament in this case is that it will provide a dead space for the root of the lung to descend during deep inspiration. And at the same time, it provides a dead space for the pulmonary veins, which are located close to it, to distend during periods of increased blood flow. These veins have a thin wall and are liable to, to distend. And so if uh, they cannot distend if they are enclosed in a tight compartment or in a tight space, but the presence of the pulmonary ligament here will provide a dead space for them that allow their distension during periods of increased blood flow. That's why the pulmonary ligament is so closely related to the pulmonary veins, but not to the pulmonary artery or to the bronchus. So which of the following structures forms the pulmonary ligament? Central tendon of the diaphragm? No, it is not related. Costal parietal pleura? No, the costal parietal pleura are related to the ribs. It is the mediastinal parietal pleura that forms the pulmonary ligament. So mediastinal parietal pleura is the correct answer. Endothoracic fascia is located outside the pleura. And the pulmonary ligament is a ligament of, or a double fold of pleura, actually, and not of the endothoracic fascia. Visceral pleura, the visceral pleura is applied to the lung tissue, directly applied to the lung tissue, and it does not form the pulmonary ligament.